The U.S.-Russia ties have hit a new low. U.S. President Donald Trump is planning to sign a legislation slapping new sanctions on Russia, the White House has announced. The White House Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders said that President Trump has read the early drafts of the bill and has negotiated regarding the critical elements of it. The President also approves of the bill and intends to sign it, is what Sarah Huckabee Sanders has said. This morning that uh, the president might veto the Russia sanctions bill, even though Senator Corker has now withdrawn his objection and the same version that we've already seen from the House is going to be up for the Senate vote. Is, is that in fact possible? Will he vote, veto a bill that passed with just three negative votes in the House and two negative votes in the Senate? As I said yesterday, uh, the president and the administration support sanctions against Russia, Iran and North Korea. We continue to support strong sanctions against those three countries. And um, we're going to wait and see what that final legislation looks like and make a decision at that point. Well, earlier White House Communications Director Anthony Scaramucci was reported as saying that Trump could sign the sanctions or may even veto it. The U.S. Senate had on Thursday voted to slap new sanctions on Russia, putting President Donald Trump in a tough position by forcing him to take a hard line on Moscow. Meanwhile, in a sharp response to the U.S. sanctions on Russia, Moscow has said that it is seizing two U.S. diplomatic properties. In a video that's been released by the foreign ministry, Russia on Friday ordered the U.S. to cut the number of its diplomats posted to Russia. The order will reduce U.S.'s diplomatic and technical staff to just 455, the same number of Russian diplomats left in the United States after Washington expelled 35 Russians in December last year. It's also seized two U.S. diplomatic properties and is suspended the use of a U.S. storage facility to Moscow and a country house. Now, President Vladimir Putin on, had also on Thursday warned that Russia had so far exercised restraint but would have to retaliate against what he described as boorish and unreasonable behaviour by the United States.